Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I thought I'd do a day in the life. It's been a super long time since I did one. Um, we have a little bit of fun stuff planned today. We're out at the pontoon. My parents have a pontoon and they're members of the boat club here. So we got our fishing gear. The boys and I are gonna go with my dad. Fox, do you wanna, are you excited? Yeah. You gonna catch some fish? <laughs> so yeah i thought i'd take you along get some good michigan scenery in um maybe later do a little bit of like life updating let you know how things are going and yeah let's get going let's get out on that river man Really good. I'm proud of you, bud. How do fish sleep? How do you fish sleep? Are you eating goldfish? Pretzels. <laughs> goldfish pretzels. Why? That's appropriate. I just caught this beautiful sunfish. You guys come and see all the colors on this. Yeah. So beautiful. Oh. <laughs> do you want to touch it? No. <laughs> all right. A big thing just happened. Desmond. Yeah! This big old sucker fish on his little Suck. tiny pole. It's a big deal. Yeah. He got the biggest fish of the day. Yeah. Great Good job. job. It's, it's They're a little freaked big. out by it, but. It's always big as Good the fish that you always catch. Today and not tomorrow, there's no. All right, you guys, we are home. We had a lovely time out on the boat. It's one of my favorite things to do, especially with my dad. We caught some good fish today. I'll show you here. Some nice big bluegills, that big old sucker fish. I'm going to fillet them up now, uh, but I will not be filming that part because I know um, this is not a fishing channel and you did not come here to watch me butcher animals. So I'm just gonna do that real quick. And then, um, yeah, we're gonna eat it tonight. All right, I have processed all of my fillets. 
I think we're gonna do like a little fish fry tonight. Normally we'd do it with the whole family, but my parents were busy tonight, so um, I'm just gonna fry them up myself. I gotta figure out what we're having for some sides. I'm feeling really, really tired now. Like being out on the boat for the morning just like takes it all out of you out in the sun. But I'm really glad we went. It was actually my first time on the boat for this season, for the summer. So it was really nice getting out there. Oh, I'm so tired. I'm trying to think if I have any life updates for you guys. Uh, Gianni is home now. His schedule has um, gone back to normal. But pretty soon he's going to start working back in the office. And he got this job like during the pandemic. So he actually hasn't worked in the office like just a handful of times. So starting next month, he's going to be going back into the office, which is about an hour away. So um, it'll definitely shake up things a little bit. But I think he's excited to go back because he can like make friends and have like the social sort of aspect about like working with a team and like getting to know his, you know, like bosses on a like deeper level and stuff. I think it's easier to like move up in a company as well when you can like make real connections with people. So he's kind of excited to go back. Um, you want to talk about your day? Oh, look who's here. What are you up to now, mister? I just want to watch hot I know an exciting thing to share with you guys. Gianni and I have booked a trip to Berlin next year. I'm so excited. I've been talking about it for ages. Um, but then, you know, everything happened and our travel plans got canceled and I finally booked it. The tickets are purchased. The hotel is booked. We will be in Berlin at the end of next March. So nine months away and I'm so, so excited. It's like really emotional and meaningful to me to go back there. It's like, it feels like it's my other home and Gianni's never been there. And I did a lot, a lot of traveling there when I was young and I have lots of friends there and I'm just really excited to show Gianni and yeah, a lot of, a lot of emotions. Last time I was there, I would like had just found out I was pregnant with Fox like a few days before I went. So I was like in an emotional tailspin the whole time I was there trying to figure out like what I was going to do if I was ready to be a mother. And I thought for sure that I would never be able to go back for the rest of my life. I would just be struggling to be a good mom and I mean, my husband wasn't my husband at the time. He was just my boyfriend. And, you know, Gianni was still, you know, waiting tables. And, like, we didn't know what the future would hold for us. So I feel like I'm at this moment right now where, like, we made it. And now I can bring him home and show him off to my beautiful city. And, like, I just am so ecstatic. It, like, it means, like, more to me than, like, just an average vacation. But, of course, you know, we used all of our Sky Miles, so we hardly had to pay anything for it. We've been saving our Sky Miles, like, you know, for five years. So I'm really, really, really excited. And, you know, be sure to subscribe and come on back in nine more months to find out how that trip goes. So cross your fingers that... uh the old pandy uh, is definitely handled by then. So yeah. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight. Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy but things are finally right With you and I the future is bright
Fisherman, it's time to go to bed. Good night, Desmond. <laughs> I love you. Good night. Good night, Fox. I love you. No, I'm not sleepy. Oh, okay. Good night. All right, you guys, the children are in bed mostly. I think Fox is gonna fall asleep pretty fast, but Desmond's in there talking. He's now reaching that phase where he doesn't want to go to bed. I know you didn't see a lot of Gianni today, but that's because it's a Thursday, so he's he worked all day. So, But I promise we'll get you on the boat next time. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. So yeah, we're probably going to eat some ice cream, watch Downton Abbey. Finally got him to watch that. I've seen it all the way through, obviously, but it's his first time. So uh, it's very exciting <laughs> for me. Yeah. So we're on, what season are we on? I think season four. Season four. Oh my God. Uh, please drop me a comment if you love Downton Abbey because it's a real thing. And he likes it too. And that makes me so happy. All right, you guys, I gotta go. The kids are out of their beds. Well, the one is the one we already discussed. So thank you so much for coming on this day in the life with me and my fam. Ugh, hold on. Uh, thanks for always watching and supporting and liking and sharing and commenting and all of the great things that you do. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done.